How you guys doing? Uh, I'm here to talk about, I want to avoid the Dark Dynasty hangover and depression. I'm going to switch it up and talk about baseball, which is my favorite sport, and the Hall of Fame inductees that just went in, class of 2015. Four players just went in, three of them pitchers, first ballot Hall of Famers. The fourth one uh, is everyday player, hard worker, Fred Biggio, uh, part of the Killer Bees, uh, Bagwell Biggio, and Derek Bell. Formable team. He's a player that you can root for, and he's a player that showed up every day that probably wasn't on steroids during the steroid era. The reason I want to focus on the pitchers, though, is because we are in that steroid era when these guys dominate, and this is impressive to me. These guys are all part of. These guys. I'll list them off first. So, Randy Johnson. You got a 6'11 guy, one of the most intimidating dudes to stand on the mound and face people throwing 90 plus miles an hour. He hit a bird in a baseball game and exploded on impact. So that's pretty intimidating and kind of scary off top. Uh, you got another guy a little shorter than him, John Smoltz, 6'3", average build guy. Uh, part of one of the most dominating rotations ever put together with two other Hall of Famers, Greg Maddox and Tom Braddock. He was very impressive. He started his career as a starter, very dominant, over 200 career wins. He got hurt midway through his career, had Tommy John surgery, came back, and became a dominant closer. He's one of the only people, I think he's the only baseball player to have over 200 career wins and 150 career saves, which is pretty impressive. We're talking about baseball that's been playing for 100 plus years at this point. Um, the third guy, my height, that's I kind of cheer him on, Pedro Martinez, 5'11, 5'12 with cleats with over uh, 165 pounds with Jerry Pearl just stripping off of him. Uh, but he was still dominant. That's the thing. All these guys have been in stature are very dominant, and it's a pitcher. To me, a pitcher in baseball is the most dominant or the premier position in sports. A lot of people. Alright, Joshua.